stories of vultures, endangered lagoons and beautiful mountainous countryside all featured today in our portrait story. Hello, it's James from the Global Portrait Project, where I'm painting 193 portraits of 193 nationalities, with each subject having a positive environmental story. Uh, today I've finished portrait uh, number two from the country of Albania. Today, representing Albania, our portrait subject is Mikhan Topi, who works as an ornithologist, conservationist and campaigner for the protection of some of South Europe's richest wild environments. I found Mirchan as a subject through a friend of a friend, Jehona Reus. Albania is found in Southern Europe and is bordered by countries beginning with M, K, N, M and G, and with a sea border with a country beginning with I. Albania's main environmental issues relate to controlling the impact of some industrial hotspots. Albania currently has one of the highest proportions of high biodiverse wild areas in any country in Southern Europe some of which are under threat from urban and industrial development. Albania is often promoted as the land of eagles and castles, so it is fitting that our subject is Mahan Topi, an ornithologist with a special interest in the globally endangered Egyptian vulture, who over the last 10 years has devoted all his time to either conservation work running educational environmental tours, or campaigning to stop the development of the Vlores Airport within the natural protection area of Yores Nata, which includes the ecologically important Nata Lagoon. In Albania, the population of the Egyptian vulture stands on the brink of extinction, with only 10 pairs remaining in the whole country. Amongst many projects Michan works with uh, includes working with local landowners to stop using poison baits for large carnivals. The Egyptian vultures are principally scavengers, so they become poisoned from eating the dead carnivals. The vulture is also personally very special to Mirhan as he met his wife when they were both studying these magnificent birds, monitoring them in the field. Mirhan is an educator and leads groups educating on wildlife and conservation in Albania. He is co-author of the first complete field guide for birds in Albania. He tries to educate the government that there is an economic value in developing nature tourism. He founded the Centre for Birds of Albania that works for the study and conservation of wild bird species. Here we see him involved with the release of a previously injured golden eagle on which he has fitted a satellite tracker. Mohan's enthusiasm and love for nature is not just about large eagles and vultures, though.
A large amount of Mohan's free time is now spent campaigning against the construction of the Vlores Airport, which is planned to bring tourism to the Vyosa Nata protected landscape, but by being built within the area is likely to have profound effects on this delicate, complex ecosystem and risks destroying the very beauty that tourists are wanting to come and see. The Nata Lagoon is one of the largest and most important wetland ecosystems in the Mediterranean. It is home to 741 animal species, including 26 globally threatened species, and is a key stop-off point for migratory birds travelling into Europe. The airport risks irreversibly damaging this ecosystem. Mohan has been campaigning both directly and through social media for years against the airport because of its serious threat to Albania's natural heritage. If you'd like to find out more about Mohan's work, the campaign against the airport, or would like to contribute to help Mohan's work, the link to the Birds of Albania website is in the description below. 
Please leave any general comments or thoughts and ideas about the airport campaign below. There is more information about this painting and how to get involved with the Global Portrait Project on the website and Instagram page, and again the links are in the description below. Next time we'll be meeting a young scientist from Algeria. <laughs>